shocked to know that a lot of police stations actually don't even have women loose, you know. And I think that's a really, really um, sorry state. But we have to end this right now. Thank you. Allow me what? Supporting cast. Okay, this I cannot take this question, Rafi. Sure. Please. Uh, the supporting cast actually is very, very interesting. Uh, they are mostly uh, all uh, like, you know, making their debuts. And uh, they're very, very interesting actors. In fact, when you see the film, I think the supporting cast will come out very, very strongly. And personally speaking, I really had a wonderful time working with them because um, they are very new and they are very fresh. And they actually come with a very different perspective in terms of, you know, performance. So I, in fact, really enjoyed performing with them. Bhavna Aunty, you didn't ask me even one question. Ask now one question, Bhavna Aunty. You're looking so pretty. One question. Which was shown in the beginning of the film. Right. When the film starts, the facts and figures which are shown about... Film starts, the trailer starts. Yeah, the trailer. So all the uh, human trafficking that's right. taking place, right. it seems like a very strong and very uh, hardcore film. It looks to me at the moment perhaps the most strong film that Yashraj Films has done of this genre. Absolutely. It must have been a very uh, traumatic experience also because you are up close with the kind of experiences these girls have gone through. Absolutely, it and was. And so many stories you must have heard. Absolutely. How did they affect you? Like in fact, uh, during the research work of the film, when uh, these uh, stories that are that we came up with, uh, which which were true facts and true stories about a lot of these trafficking things and about the policing, in fact, uh, because we had to delve into the trafficking, we also had to delve into the life of the police, and we actually got to know so many facts which were very very disturbing, and uh, and. Through this film, I think we've we've taken a step to basically try and speak those things out, um, and and tell people about what things are happening. Um, caution the parents to, in fact, you know, the uh, parents who have daughters um, and the girls to basically tell them that the way trafficking happens today in cities in broad daylight is very scary, and it's just a way from our side to basically. Um, tell the society that obviously as entertainers, we can only do it through the medium of films because we don't really have any other power otherwise. So I think through the entertainment medium, through a film, we've uh, tried to speak these points out. Also, you'll be shocked to know that a lot of police stations actually don't even have women lose, you know? And I think that's a really, really um, sorry state uh, to have so many female police officers in the country and not have female toilets, you know, and uh, it, it, it begins there. And uh, it's, it's just the uh, fact, the way we look at female officers, you know, that, oh, she's a female officer, so what could she do? You know, she can't be as strong as a man. And I think that's the kind of um, um, perspective that we are hoping to change with this film. We are trying to portray a very strong female cop. And the strong female cop is nothing to do with anything fictional. It's very, very real. There are cops like Shivani Shivaji Rao. There are cops who are absolutely strong that if they slap you, you can actually go into a tizzy. And I actually, during my research, during my research work, I had an officer slap one of the boys uh, just for a, a kind of a, a training session that I was going through. And it was quite a resounding slap. Um, just to actually show the strength that these female officers have. Um, and it's brilliant. It's very, very inspiring. I was very inspired. Uh, but yes, uh, through Shivani Shivani Joy, we are showing one aspect of how strong they are and what they can do and what lens they can go. Because I've actually had talks with so many of the senior cops, you know, uh, where they have told me that, Rani, you will be surprised that there are so many female cops who I want to tell you are not only as good as the men, but sometimes they're even better. And that gives us great encouragement to actually come out with a film of female cop. And I hope that through the film we have, um, I hope we are successful in successfully portraying a female cop in the right spirit. And I think the, not yet. Uh, it's obviously going to go soon. But I think the title Mardani is very apt for a film like this. And uh, through the film, we're also trying to inspire girls to actually bring out the spirit of Mardani. 
uh, from inside them. And I think when every girl turns out to be a mardani, I think mardo ka zada zor nahi chalne wala hai tabhi. I think, and I think it's it's on every girl to basically take up her case personally. Uh, if she is violated, I think she is the first one to stand up and uh, uh, speak for herself, rather than wait for somebody else to speak up for her. So I think that's the basic message to the film. Hope you enjoy the film, Bhavnanti, and love you. Okay, thank you very much. <laughs>